Hello and welcome to Womanism, the channel dedicated to exploring and understanding the position of women in different religions. Today we are going to talk about how Buddhist women engage with social and ethical issues, such as gender justice, environmentalism, and peace. Buddhist women, as practitioners and agents of Buddhism, have been actively involved in addressing and resolving these issues, both within and outside the Buddhist community. They have used their voices, skills, and resources to promote and advocate for the values and ideals of Buddhism, and to contribute to the well-being and harmony of all beings. One of the most pressing and pervasive issues that Buddhist women face is gender justice, which refers to the fair and equal treatment of women and men in all aspects of society. Gender justice is not only a matter of human rights, but also a matter of spiritual significance, as it affects the dignity and potential of every human being. Buddhist women have been challenging and transforming the structures and attitudes that discriminate and oppress women, both in the secular and religious spheres. They have been demanding and creating more opportunities and spaces for women to participate and lead in various fields and domains, such as education, politics, economics, culture, and spirituality. They have also been supporting and empowering other women, especially those who are marginalized and vulnerable, such as refugees, victims of violence, and poor and illiterate women. Fun fact! One of the most prominent and influential Buddhist women who has been working for gender justice is Jetsunma Tenzin Palmo, who is one of the few Western women to have been ordained as a Tibetan Buddhist nun. She is the founder and director of a monastery for Tibetan nuns in India, where she provides them with education, training, and spiritual guidance. She is also the author of several books and a speaker and advocate for the rights and roles of Buddhist women. She is best known for her 12-year retreat in a cave in the Himalayas, where she practiced meditation and austerity. Another important and urgent issue that Buddhist women engage with is environmentalism, which refers to the protection and preservation of the natural environment and its resources. Environmentalism is closely related to the Buddhist concept of interdependence, which recognizes that all phenomena are connected and interrelated, and that the actions of one affect the well-being of all. Environmentalism is also inspired by the Buddhist concept of compassion, which extends to all living beings, not only humans, and which motivates one to act for the benefit of others, not only oneself. Buddhist women have been raising awareness and educating others about the causes and consequences of environmental degradation and climate change, and the need for ecological responsibility and sustainability. They have also been initiating and participating in various projects and campaigns that aim to conserve and restore the environment, such as planting trees, cleaning rivers, recycling waste, and promoting green and organic lifestyles. Fun fact! One of the most notable and inspiring Buddhist women who has been working for environmentalism is Aya Kima, who was a German-born Theravada Buddhist nun and teacher. She was the founder and abbot of Parapudua Nuns Island, a small island off the coast of Sri Lanka, where she established a forest monastery and an ecological center for nuns and laywomen. She was also involved in the Sarvodaya movement, a grassroots social development organization that promotes self-reliance, democracy, and peace in Sri Lanka. She was a prolific writer and speaker, and a pioneer of the global Buddhist women's movement. Buddhist women engage with social and ethical issues, such as gender justice, environmentalism, and peace, in various and meaningful ways. They use their Buddhist values and practices as the basis and motivation for their social and ethical actions, and they use their social and ethical actions as the expression and manifestation of their Buddhist values and practices. They demonstrate that Buddhism is not only a religion but also a way of life that is relevant and responsive to the needs and challenges of the contemporary world. They also show that women are not only followers but also leaders and agents of Buddhism, and that they have a significant and positive impact on the world. Thank you for watching this episode of Womanism. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more content on women and religion. See you next time.